Alright, what's up everyone? Empowered Qs here, bringing you a little bit more League of Legends action. We are playing some uh, Korean Garen in the top lane. I was just, uh, everyone was asking me how to beat Garen on Jack, so I kind of hopped on to OP.GG and checked out what Koreans were doing on Garen. And there's a guy in Masters tier who's running a Demolish, Second Wind, and Unflinching with Garen. So it seems pretty good. So uh, he always takes Ignite and the build is Black Cleaver, Dead Man's Plate, into... Boy there. Don't want to get... Uh, this Tom Kent ran Hail of Blade, so he's going to look for those quick three auto attacks into a Feast to kind of do some damage. Uh, his Feast does... Uh, uh, percentage health is magic damage, so it does a deceptively amount... A, a deceptive amount of damage. Holy moly. So just, that's what he's trying to do. So that's what we're looking to avoid. So yeah, as long as we uh, avoid the tongue, we should be okay. And then whenever you have the little fish on you, uh, that's one of the three stacks he needs in order to swallow you. So it's three stacks, then when you're red, you can get stunned or silenced. And that can be uh, stunned by the lashing of the tongue as well. That sounds so weird to say. My goodness. So yeah, there's the stun right there. He's dead. Yep, got it. Just make sure I get underneath tower range. I need to put this in because I don't have... Right, might be dead here. If he tries to lick me, I have to go for... Ooh. Come on, no! Diana, I hate you! He's gonna run me back. Oh god! Oh my god! I tried. That's okay. So I'm gonna start building towards my, uh, my phage here. <laughs> he TP'd, that's fine. I'll take it, still got first blood. I mean, that's a... That's a Diana gets. I mean, at any point you could have roamed top. Like, they chased me from here all the way here, and Diana was stuck there. I think she maybe got like two CS from it, but whatever. Oh, uh, he also takes tenacity. So the unflinching, whenever I cast the ignite, is going to increase my tenacity, which is really going to help against Tom Kench. And then I took the legend tenacity as well. I'm just going to chill for a second. He's got the uh, level advantage on me, so no point in getting too aggressive. I could clear pretty well under tower, so. Top Kench isn't really a big bully underneath tower as well, so if he wants to push the wave, I'm actually pretty okay with that. I have second wind and Dorn shield to kind of negate any of that. God. So what is it? 13 to 22. Pretty good. Yeah, that's the only thing I'm really worried about in this matchup is getting ganked by the Hecarim over and over again. Back up this way. Back up the tongue. Dodge it out. Nice. So now see, he only has his potions to rely on for regeneration where I have my passive and the Doran shield and second wind. So it allows you to honestly take uh, some quote unquote pretty stupid trades. Attack speed. Whoop, dodge that. I got my grasp ready. Find all this. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man now 
I did go to ward because I knew Aatrox was there. I have a, I had a feeling that this uh um Hecker was gonna camp the crap out of me. I mean, it's hard to plan because sometimes you just don't get jungle pressure. I know that all too well. Uh, but honestly, I feel like the best way to counter Garen is punish his lack of mobility. He just doesn't have a whole lot of escapes. So if you can punish that, it's really, really good. So Demolish has a 45 second cooldown, so you want to get that proc whenever you can. So gonna continue towards my Black Cleaver. That's a super nice buy. And then the dead man's plate's gonna be really nice too, because I can hit the Tom Kench and slow him. So up some CS, up a couple kills. We only died that once when we traded, which isn't bad considering a uh, jungle came, and I would have lived without the jungler. So going uh, one for one when it's a two v one is pretty darn good. A little behind in CS, but not awful. So rest of it looks okay. This is kind of a pretty heavy split pushy kind of lane anyway. Split push kind of build anyways. So. Not gonna get too aggressive for the second. Might run in to get my cannon though. Spin there. That's fine. On my potion. Silence him, walk away. Like I said, I got all this regeneration anyways. Honestly, I might flash uh do that. Oh, shoot. I put an extra point into my E. Don't worry about that. Max Q first. <laughs> yeah. So that that's the Wicked Garen combo. I've been at the wrong end of that a few times where he just flashes you, silences you, and then, and then gets that big ultimate on you. Boy, uh, bot lane not going so well. like I was supposed to. Alright, and then try to get this proc right here. Yikes. Tom catches back there, so I'm gonna try and get first turret. Since I have the demolish, I actually might be able to. I probably that anyway. I got first turret. I'd say worth it. I'll take it. I will take it. Um, definitely gonna go Merc Treads this game. Holy moly. So my goal is probably just to keep split pushing. Tom probably, yeah. Whew, Tom Flash. That's probably why they switched with the Lissandra. She also ignited. See how little damage she did to me though? You prop your, uh, Pop your W at the right time. Because I had turret hitting me, she ignited me, she used her ultimate on me, she used her W on me, and I just stood there tanking it. Yikes. So now I'm going to shred a bunch of armor. The dead man's plate's going to help me catch uh, some of these guys in a team fight. Like if I end up hitting the Ezreal, I'll get that nice big slow on him, which will be good. So hopefully my uh, team does not completely end. So I'm probably going to start pushing out these lanes. Might have to group a little bit. Because I think I'm just going to continuously get collapsed on if I don't. An ally has been slain. Yeah, Tom Kench is just making plays. They're all going bottom. I'm not going to make it there in time. So I should just split. <laughs> See TK, they're gonna grab the uh dragon. An ally has been Yikes. Not my W. Yeah, they're just gonna keep sending my on to keep up with my split push. Hmm. Walk this way. Hmm. 
I gotta be really careful for the... Uh... Yeah. worried about the house because I'm just gonna reach on it all with my passive anyways and second wind well I guess I didn't just take damage but I'm gonna regenerate all of it oh, she's gotta be careful they're probably coming push this wave out yeah I don't know what this R is doing this should push she did she did My goal is kind of like a Trindomir in this game is to just be a nuisance around the map and split push so they have to keep answering waves and kind of tear them apart that way. Like me versus this Tom Kench, like look at the farm difference. Potion, run towards mid. Maybe I could catch this Lissandra. So if I catch her. I don't have enough distance. Nope. Pop the potion. That's fine. That's fine. What? That's fine. Mm. Whoa! Yeah. Whole lot of nothing I can do about that. Maybe I can get a kill on Tom, that'll help me push. Kills around the map I can. He's not really worth much, but... Unfortunate. I have to get out of here in a second. I have a feeling uh, I will be having friends. Yep. Flash? Yeah, I'm just gonna flash. I don't know if she has alt or not. Not worth dying. Not worth dying. Wait, 25 gold. <gasps> I knew it! I probably didn't have to pull the alt. Oh well. Um, so let's see here. I'm gonna finish my dead mans and then go for sterics. And I am gonna be super freaking tanky. I'll probably grab a spirit visage next just because uh, it's gonna help against Desira. And then Lissandra really is gonna have a hard time killing me. Not that she doesn't already. <laughs> 
So the uh, the idea behind a successful split push is become the one that they have to send two people to kill you, and then you can let that make it difficult. So while Garen has no real escape mechanisms, he can become a nuisance to kill. So there's lots of people, man. So if I could push this tower in. I got my demolish. Run mid, maybe. Damn, they're super low, but I do not have anything to use for them. I think she's too slippery. Oh, nice. Take this. Oh, God. No, can't do anything there. See if they can. I gotta be careful and watch where I'm going. Don't know where the Lissandra went. Yep, had a feeling. Nothing really for me to go back for. I don't have enough money to get my dead man. Hopefully, nope. I was gonna say, hopefully she's getting that power. Run it back top, boys. Damn. Yeah, that's why I gotta keep going top, I think. Like, these four are just way too nimble for me to catch. Cool. What does the Tom Kench have? He still doesn't have, like, anything, so... He's not worth the time. Yeah, he's dead. Ari's just AFK bot lane. Yike. Going for Rift Herald. I probably should back. I think I definitely have friends incoming. So time to back it up. Maybe I can get this. Oh, no, there's not enough time. Not enough time. Let's see Lissandra. Damn, he ate him! I fucking had him! No! Oh, man. Damn you, Tom Kedge. Damn you. Damn, I gave away that shutdown gold to him as well. I boosted Flash. I panicked Flash, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, but now I have the dead man's plate. Start working towards my Sterics gauge. It's gonna be super tanky. Really good. Good stuff. He's probably gonna kill off that top tower so I can collect that farm. It's nice that, that gives a little movement speed as well. Not worth it. He's gonna hit that no way, yeah. The 
this uh, Tom Kent's trying to make the big plays. Alright. I don't know what I can do here because I don't have flash or anything, but I'm on my way. Let's do it. I'll cut up the rear. is still accomplished. Oh, God! I can't make it! <laughs> Let my passive come back up. This needs to be perfect. is uh, my target with my ultimate. Oh, didn't even need it. Hot damn. That was really good. They should get the dragon. We are... What? What? Don't know how I died. Must have been ultimate. Yeah, I don't know how I ever catch this Ezreal without, like, flash. That's still up. Yeah, I'm gonna take that. Nice. Must be great for my split push. Not want to fight me at all. Oh, I see Hacker up three tower. Don't mind if I do. So look at all this pressure I've got. I'm gonna maybe even get a top tower. Don't let them back. Fuck your time catch! Alright. Now I'm gone! I'm gone! I got a nice amount of damage on there. I'll take it. To get off a big buy here. Look at that health regain! Here it goes, here it goes. Got a nice amount of tenacity. We're gonna grab that. Sell this, because I don't need it anymore. I'm gonna try and keep pushing top lane down. So this is when your team's doing really badly. This is one way that you can win is you pick a very sustaining type champion, render their top laner useless, and just keep the split push on. Realistically, I want to be bot lane because Baron's the next objective. But and plus, like I said, I'm never catching these guys. Yeah, you better run. Down. Get rid of the slow here. They're all out of fortress. They're all uh, bot lane. If they can keep a bot, I can get this tower. Because I'll have my. Ah, uh... uh, try to get this. Try to keep an eye on who I see. I don't see anyone anymore, so I gotta be careful. See Hecarim. I can't 2v1, so gotta run. See you later. Damn. Let's see if I can get a uh, scuttle crab real quick. Let's see here. Oh god. Oh, he ran. Okay. They want a piece of the gear. That would give me some nice vision. Someone's probably coming. I 
still silence somebody. Yikes! What do I need? I need 500 more gold. Use all my regen. Get some vision up here. Man, that Tom Kench, he is tanky! Get rid of this. Like I said, this is what I mean by being a menace. They keep having to send multiple people up to me, so hopefully that continuously is time that my team can get plays. Or just at least not die. Actually, we have that. Don't get hit by that. As soon as that falls off, I can go back in. Like I said, my goal isn't even necessary to kill him at this point, is to try and just push in the wave. Three are dead. Who's left alive? Lissandra and Tom. Like I said, if I can get my Demolish proc on it, that should be the tower. Nope. Lissandra's there. Can't go up. They're all gonna be back, too. Lane! Well, we got, a uh, mid-tower because of that push. I can go get my Sterix, and then, uh, definitely think a Spirit Visage. Cool. That'll give me, uh, some more cooldown reduction, too. Keep the split alive! Look at that, level 14 to 15, almost level 16. Really want that top tower. So this is gonna uh, give me even more tenacity. So with this prox, I'm gonna get the bonus 30% tenacity there. If I pop my ignite, I'm gonna get the tenacity from that, or my flash. Oh, come on. Three of them, nothing I can do. Not that I can put look how many people they sent me. It took the Hecarim, the Tom Kench, like just push the wave. Ari's boosted. I don't know what they can really do. That was clutch. I'll still take it, and this Ari gets nothing done. That was a really good engage by the, uh, um, from the Rakan. Yeah, I don't know. Don't know. The problem is I just can't make it through the Tom Kent's defenses enough to kill him, and they suck too much for me to get a split push on enough to... Please don't tank. Don't take my farm. I'm actually accomplishing something. I might just grab a last whisper. <laughs> Because I feel like I'm tanky enough, but... Alright. Gotta get, uh... Otherwise, we're just all gonna die. Oh, oh, grab this. Yeah, I'm never gonna catch that Ezreal. There's just so much CC. Really good too. I just couldn't get to any of them. That sucks. That really sucks. I tried to R a bunch of times.
Got that one. I'm coming. I'm coming. You better run, bitch. Run. Nice. Hell yeah. This Rakan is putting in work. This Rakan is putting in some work. That's a good couple of barons. Resist. Nice. Gonna get this wave and then back. How close am I? Pretty close. Pretty close. I don't know who's coming. Okay. I'm coming. Rampage. How, oh, I tell you. How? Do this! Let's kill him! Oh no! The hacker up! He is so fast! Yikes! Ah, uh, man! I don't care. I'm getting some arm more armor shred because here comes Ari. She's gonna do something now. She did something. I was kidding. Didn't think she'd do anything. Hell yeah. Maybe I just get Ghost Blade. Because that would give me some penetration and some speed up. Both of which are things that I want at this moment. Hmm. Curious. Okay. Well, Sandra's. Oh, she does not have Zonias. Hmm. I mean, she kind of does, but you get what I mean. We need to uh, ward. She is just AFK splitting like nobody's business. Man. I don't think we can kill him. He's too tanky. Get there quick. Yeah. Oh, 
I kill you! Oh, I thought he was. I ignited, so that does go through. Nice! Oh, uh, Back up. Back up. Oh god, he hurts! He hurts! Run away! Save me! Save me! Save me! I live! I run! Gotcha, bitch! Ha! I got health regained like a madman! Get my shield on! Yeah! What up? Woo! Get my ghost blade! <laughs> the hard Garen carries! I have 4,000 health! Full build! Damn! Oh, that is so huge. Team back here. Team! Oh my god, that was so funny! Not enough of our team came. That is unfortunate. Yes, we can now. Gotta heal. Useless people. Lame. Gonna push this wave in. Man, man. Come on. They spent so much time chasing the Lissandra. I'm coming. Coming. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I'm out! I'm out! I live! I live! <laughs> Didn't even phase me! And then I'm just gonna regain it all. Man, this game was not ending. In real quick. I want to buy a potion. I wonder if it's worth uh, selling my boots for a guardian angel. I gotta watch out for the collapse. That's problem is Tom Kench can use Hecarim to collapse. Oh god. I'm just gonna use all my movement speed. Damage shot at this point, and then I'm running. Damage. Damn, Tom Kent. Alright. Taking some power shots. No biggie. Wait for the wave. Oh my god, did you see that hit? Yikes. Get our prize. Woo! That should be game. GG. 
Holy moly, that was a rough one. Yeah, you get the Dead Man's proc, which does damage to towers, I think, uh, plus your Demolish. I mean, the Split Push Menace. I mean, nice, dude. What's up, guys? What's up? What's up? Sorry, middle of recording, so I, I wasn't looking at chat. That was, that was a game. Uh, give it to the, uh, the Diana. What a boosted. Yes. Man, all of the honors. Rough stuff. <laughs> Yikes! Let's check out the damage charts. Not bad. That Diana put in work later. I think Lissandra's super underrated, too. So, yeah, like I said, that was the build there. So, you'd go demolish so you can take towers really fast. It works really, really well with the Dead Man's Plate. Second win plus Doran Shield starting allows you to make some goofy mistakes or take some really, really aggressive trades where you can just sit back and reheal. Unflinching, when you go in for the all-in, you get the tenacity bonuses from that. Your boots, the tenacity when Steric's gauge procs, then you get the tenacity from Legends. Because uh, that's one of biggest, uh, Garen's biggest weaknesses, you know, is being kited out. So, you know, when you're playing Jax, for example, uh, you want to E his uh, Q, and then stun him, get a few hits, and then jump away. All that tenacity decreases the stun. Well, I hope you guys liked that one. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good jazz. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.